Hey, Roger here for the Real Estate Minute. People asked me, they said, Roger, what is this seller's disclosure? What is that? Well, that's a form. I've got one on the screen here, and I know it's kind of too small for you to get the detail out of it, but that's a bunch of questions you know, about the roof, the plumbing, the guttering, air conditioner, everything about the house. Y'all scroll down. There's like, you know, what's it, four pages? One, two, three, four, maybe five pages, like five pages long, six pages. And it's got all kinds of questions. And then you can explain, you know, if something's ever leaked, did you get it fixed and all that. So anyway, a seller is required to fill this out. And you have to be honest by law. You have to tell anything that you know of that might not quite be right with the house. And every house has got some stuff that's not quite right, you know. But when you make an offer as a buyer, you read this over very carefully. Um, you ask any questions you need to ask and you sign off on that. Because what you're saying is when you make an offer is you're not expecting any of this to be fixed. This is what the seller has already told you. This is where the house is. This is what it's like. The inspection is a whole different deal. We'll talk about that in another video. But this is called the seller's disclosure. If you're a seller, you got to fill this out accurately. If you're a buyer, you got to read it over carefully before you make your offer. Thanks for watching.